Hi, this is Ike from Groovy Entertainment. Today's video is me opening a box of 1990 baseball cards that I found in in, in my collection. Now, I had bought this thing, well, decades ago, as you see, and it had never been opened before. So I'm curious who were the baseball players back in the days, if there are any kind of rookie cards or any kind of specially card that's inside this package. Now, this thing said 10, 10 years, wait, 10 years anniversary edition. So that might have something in here that might be worth something. Now, like I said before, I am a collector of baseball cards, but I do not save the wrapper or nothing. So I'm not afraid of opening this thing. It's not worse. It's not fun if you can't look at what's, what, what you're wanting. Most people wouldn't open this pack of the cards because it's worth more when it's not open. But I like looking at the, the, the people in the cards. And I just saw my other baseball thing. I have a binder full of baseball cards that are kept nice and safe. So let's see what we got in this thing. Now in here, it says... Let's see if I if if this thing was so brown or it's so brown, I could pay four ninety nine for some kind of official fleet collector pen, and you just give your name and address and send it to them. Let's see a limited edition fleet baseball card for I think some. Oh, they got a lot of things on the back of this thing. Too bad I'm a little too late for it. Now, I don't know if they still make baseball cards. You can leave it in the comments if they still make these things. Boy. Well, there goes the wrapper. Now, I don't think they know bubblegum in this stuff. So I don't have to worry about that. Okay, first we got a quiz. I'm not going to read the quiz, though. And, okay, this is for the Oakland people. Now, I never saw, I I know the Oakland still play, but i never seen this old-fashioned symbol of theirs. Now, these are made out of uh, uh, cardboard, it looks like. Cardboard cards. Now, here's our first baseball player. I know it's not hard, yeah, either read well, if you know who Scott Bailey, I think it's Scott Bailey is. And if anyone be run with these baseball players, now he's from the Indians, so he's a pitcher. So we got a pitcher. We got a Mets, David Cohn. We got another pitcher from a different team. So we got two pitchers from two different teams. We got Jeff. He had another pitcher from the Baltimore Orioles. They we just get a lot of pitchers. Yeah, I think we just got a lot of pitchers in this one. Here's Tommy Green from the Braves. Another pitcher. Now, these got numbers on them. I'll, I'll talk about the numbers after we do the, the players. Okay, here's the outfielder, Deion Sander. Now, I think I heard this guy from the New York, from the New York Mets. I think he played in the, in the 80s side of it, like the 86. I know my love can't make sure the picture too good. I don't know. Uh, Terry, Terry, another pitcher from. I don't know what the P stands for. And that's telling me on the back of this card. If you know what this symbol stands for, it's another pitcher. Uh, we got second base. Let's see, Julio. Fresco. And this is from the Texas Rangers. 
We got an outfielder. Uh, no, second base. Now we got someone named Derek. And he's a pitcher from the Braves. So we got two Braves. I remember that. I remember his face from the 1987 baseball that he played in. You don't forget faces. So now we got two Braves. And we'll put them in order when I get done talking about all the other cards. Here's the Fred. And this is from the Detour Tigers. And this is the he's a hitter. Then we got boy. We got another pitcher from the Dodgers. I think this is the first Dodgers we have. Here's another Baltimore Oreos. We got an outfielder. Brady Anderson. Yeah, like I said, my webcam ain't that clear. <laughs> Here's another one. This is from the Astros. Jim. He's a pitcher. Here's another one. See, this is a third. <coughs> Either dusty. This is from the Oakland, and this is the third base. Now, so far, I don't see nothing special in here. Here's your Chicago White Sox. Here's Matt the catcher. And our last card, Joe Oliver, the catcher from the Reds. Can't read the small print. <laughs> yeah, I think most of these people should be kicking. Now let's see what the back. Let's see what teams put them in the team in number order. All right, this is four oh six, four twenty six. This is five forty two. 14. I don't think we got a number one. Do we got a number one in this map? See, we got 200. 400. We got the 400 series. 190, 193. Or 173. Here's 454. It's 26. I think we don't got these in any kind of order because they're no number one. Okay, let's see what kind of let's see how many people are in the baseball game in this sense. I know we had two Baltimore. Let's see. We had no, we only had one Brave. We had two Braves. So now on the Brave side, we got a we got two pitchers for the Braves. These two guys. And I know we had one for the Oreos. No. Not the White Sox. Here we go. We got an uh, outfield, uh, outfielder, the pitcher for the Oreos. And no, no, no. So all the other teams are just one card, but this is a lot of cards. Fifteen of uh, you get fifteen cards for whatever I spent back in nineteen ninety. <laughs> I have no clue what I spent because this is thirty four years ago. But on the back of this thing. Here we go. See, so I could have got a pen for four ninety nine. On here, I could have got 
Be the first to collect the limited edition baseball card sets. Fleet 1990 All-Star Team 12-card set random package. And League C standout 6-card set and 3 packs only. So there was a whole bunch of them that I could have collected back in the days. But I'm happy to have the 15 card that I did have. So if any of you ever heard of these teams or these players, leave me in the comments. And if you collect baseball cards back in the days, leave me in the comments also. It'd be nice to see who collects baseball cards also. And whenever I do see baseball cards in the Walgreens or Ocean State or any kind of department stores, I try to pick them up because these things are worth something. And you get them when they're cheap, but nobody collects baseball cards of them. So please like, subscribe, share, and comment. Have a groovy day with another video coming out real soon.